good news is the water is receding here very quickly from Deer Creek where it flooded earlier this morning. I can show you Manchester Road as we speak. You can see that while there are still emergency crews at the scene here with lights flashing, cars are able to navigate their way down Manchester Road to give you a landmark. As I mentioned earlier, we are right by the Train Wreck Saloon. That's a restaurant and pub that a lot of folks in this area would know. The water here has been receding quickly just within the past 15 or 20 minutes. Before that, it was much higher on Manchester Road and also Rockwood Industrial Court which is right here as well. I want to show you some video earlier when the scene here was unfolding. We've been gathering information from authorities, and here is what we know. This all started about 3.50 this morning. Deer Creek flooded its banks in this area, and there was a semi-driver who was waiting to pick up a load from the Forest Products Lumber Company right here on Manchester Road. He was actually sleeping in his semi at the time, the water rose so quickly that the Brentwood Fire Department and the Rock Hill Fire Department had to respond. Brentwood put a boat in the water here on Manchester Road to go rescue that driver out of his semi. Fortunately, he was okay. No injuries there. There was also another car, according to the Brentwood Fire Chief, that was literally floating down this area. The water was so deep and it was moving so fast. Fortunately, there was nobody inside of that car. We spoke earlier with the Brentwood Fire Chief, Ronnie Cottrell, about the challenges in navigating this area with the rescue boat. Take a listen to what Chief Cottrell told us. Over uh, Manchester Road, the water is rather shallow, um, but still swift enough, deep enough to sweep away a vehicle. Um, once you got off of Manchester Road into Rock Hill Industrial, the water became much deeper. And, it, and it's moving, it's moving uh, products from the lumber yard, um, so it's very dangerous uh, waterways. So this was your classic flash flooding situation. The water came up, now it's going back down. But as Chief Cottrell said, for a while there, you had lumber floating in this area. There was some concern that the semi may have been leaking fuel. That turned out not to be the case. So the situation here seems to be resolving itself. As you can see, we can see Manchester Road again. About a half hour ago, it still looked like a mini lake out here. So the water going down fast, things getting back to normal, but certainly a really nervous and tense situation here earlier as this water was rising, as we have seen before, out of this Deer Creek area, rises fast, then goes down fast. Good news, no injuries from this water rescue here from that semi driver earlier this morning. For now, live in Rock Hill, Chris Renier, Fox News.